using the band to pull it sideways in a single leg hip hinge position. So what the band does, it's going to get your hip firing off. We need enough tension so that it's pulling you sideways. It doesn't have to be a ton. But once we go into single leg and the band's pulling you sideways, that hip's going to kick in to help stabilize your position. Now, other than the band being in there, all your rules apply for proper hip hinge as well as executing the row. So we're going to make sure that you get your hip back behind your ankle. If you're able, we'd like to get you all the way down to parallel. The more upright you are, the more your angle needs to be a little bit backwards with your pull. If you're able to get to that horizontal position, straight up and down. And I like to make sure we're really getting some good back work in there. So if you take the other arm and simply ghost as if you're doing a bilateral row, you're going to get a much better pinch between your shoulder blades as you pull. So enough tension to pull you sideways, keep your belly button pointing to your down foot so your hips are square, good hip hinge, and then as we row, both arms really pinch the shoulder blades even though the weight's only on one side. 